Hi, Scott from Digital Fish with content that catches. I had had a good trip out to Little Barrier a while back, but disaster struck when I somehow misloaded one of my GoPro cameras, so I'll do my best to tell the story with half the footage. It was about a 40 minute ride to Little Barrier, and with a great sunrise in front of me, anticipation was high. It's been quite a while since I was out there. It's a place that seldom disappoints. While I'm fishing on my own, I carry an ACR PLB in case I get into trouble. Out here, a little barrier, and uh, just happened to stumble upon the fish. Maybe there's fish everywhere, I don't know, but uh, almost every drop, uh, good fish. Oh, there we go, another little hit there. Nice snapper. <coughs> third drop, third fish. I just happened to be on them today, so very lucky. Nice fish. Um, oh, I was in again, briefly, uh, but he just he just got off as soon as I turned the camera on, which uh, cameras have that effect sometimes on fish. Thought I'd hooked the bottom, then the bottom took off. Oh! And uh, snapper as fishing's going off, I had uh, like six drops, four fish, bites every drop. Um, yeah, nice looking fish and uh, it's like only 8.30 in the morning so uh, shaping up to be an awesome day. The fishing was consistent with easy drifts over the contour lines. The Shimano bottom jigs were getting hit by a number of different species. I've seen a school sort of about 20 metres down, maybe 10 metres. I'm going to give it a go for a bit of a jig. Sometimes you just never know what, uh, what's looking down there. So, wind's starting to drop off. It's kind of changed the drift again uh, from where I was. Bottom ship is, uh, yeah, had to go back to the bottom ship to start getting some more bites. Well, I just had a hit, brought it up, felt like um, a bit of sponge, really, wasn't fighting, just a bit of weight, and uh, got near the surface, it was a squid. Never caught a squid on a bottom ship before, but uh, pity he didn't stay on, I would have uh, I would have kept him for sure. You can see the sign, now you can see the fish. Oh, fighting like a snapper, but uh, looking like a blue cod. There we go. Might have to go follow this one. Hook something pretty decent. Um, he's just he's just taking line. I've got nothing back so far. I've got 300 meters on here. Um, I'm thinking probably a kingfish. Yeah, he's still going. He's just going. And he's still going. Yeah, I think we might have to fire up the engine and go chase this one. It's uh, coming up really high in the water column. Could be a 20 kilo car away, about to jump, but most likely a kingfish. Obviously Puka don't come to the surface like this, Big Snapper don't, so I'm pretty confident it's a good sized kingfish, well, you know, 10 kilos maybe. It's funny, I thought I was gaining line but I was mistaken, we, I pulled the engine neutral because I thought I was gaining ground but uh, he's still swimming hard out in the westerly direction, I don't know how far 
where I've gone. Good thing I was getting a bit uh, bored for those snapper coming aboard. It's getting a bit bored, you know, snapper after snapper, or something a bit different. Blue cod, red pig fish. He's decided he wants to go back inshore now, so we're going back into the little barrier. He came up in the water column and now he's, he's gone back down again. Have to throw the boat in neutral, and he's straight down. Make sure I don't run over the line, that'll be a flat out tragedy. Turn the boat around, have another go around. I, I haven't got any line back from uh, being able to pull the rod on him so far. So far it's just the boat following him. I've just got, I've had, haven't been able to put any, any pressure on to bring him back up. Well, sadly the hook pulled after 40 minutes, just when he was about 15 metres under the boat. I decided it was time to go up the northern side of the island and have a look around and take the drone for a fly. That was my day. With the setting sun, I powered up the Honda and headed for home. I'd forgotten how amazing this place can be. This is Scott from Digital Fish with content that catches.